funny thing happened in the morning because even my mom it's something that she didn't expect to happen you know because for a long time it's actually going on to 10 years now of just doing um, art professionally say actually see oh mingi just in gesema to asante sana prof because i feel like um ile kazi unafanya it's very relevant it's very necessary sana sana for for somebody like me mwenye because i also went through the system and i i got really really discouraged because i believe it reached the point where you feel ni kama um, what you're doing haina maana tena you know so ni gesema to asante um um even my daughter gets to see me graduate, so that's another blessing on top of that. Um, I guess I'm too uh, Santi Sana. Uh, mine is to thank Prof for what is happening today. It's a great blessing for us. It's true that uh, you really clean off the dust from our fallen children. And as parents, we tend to focus so much on academics. Anthony was at the University of Nairobi. Uh, bachelor of Science, Maths and Physics, and he's a dropout. He was a dropout then. And uh, he started his, uh, uh, I remember spoken word, his uh, beatbox, and everything. I watched him severally performing, because we felt that uh, well, he wasn't doing the right thing, because our focus was on academics. Of course, I being a teacher, and his father, Light father having been a teacher, we were books, books, and books. And we knew that all along it's all about books. But uh, today I've learned something very important that I'll carry even to my colleagues, my family, including the proponents of the CBC. In fact, I'm going to echo your sentiments that it's all about talents, it's all about gifted children, it's about uh, what we can make out of them from their abilities and support them as much as we, could, we can so that uh, we can also have the parents, more parents attending this kind of graduation. In fact, we're going to really advertise this when we leave here, Professor. Hallelujah. So thank you once again, and may God bless you. Thank you.